Is everyone ready? All aboard Pennsylvania Line, East Coast Local, stopping at Loganville, New Salem, York. Are y'all ready? What? Oh. There's food in Just restart. There's ants. Yeah. Yeah, there's ants. Okay. You ready? All aboard Pennsylvania Line, East Coast Local, stopping at Loganville, New Salem, York. Morons! Complete and utter morons! I mean, did they even read our reviews? A powerhouse night theater, the New York Times. You made that one up. How could the loyal order of the new slug move us off stage? Us! Leo, do you really want to do Shakespeare your whole life? Yes! What about what I want? Kids? Na no, neighbors? A family? But Jack, all we need is a break. How much do we have as of right now? Nothing. But, but, what about last night? Our show for the Moose people. They wouldn't pay us. The great acts had one more soliloquy, and he would have lost the herd. Perhaps we should do a whole play next time. But, Jack, it's just the two of us. We have seven costumes from different plays. And a pinch we could put on. One gentleman from Broome. The taming of Merry Wife in Windsor. Much ado about Hamlet. All right. All right. <laughs> All right. Hamburger. Hamburger. All right. <laughs> Jack, take a look at this. <laughs> oh, Max Osti, millionaire's Florence Snyder. Florence Snyder. <laughs> Shut up. Florence Snyder. Florence Florence Snyder of York is reportedly searching for her sister's children. Florence when, Snyder. as children, they sailed to England with their mother. Repeated telegrams and advertisements in American England have failed to get a response. She can't find them. And apart from a niece named Matt, she wants to leave him her money. So what? So what? Jack, look at us. Promotion. We could be brothers. <laughs> oh, stop it. We can't pretend to be somebody we're not. Besides, it's illegal. But Jack, we wouldn't be hurting anyone. Uh, what about her niece, Meg? The heck with her. She'll get plenty instead of three million. She gets one million, and you get one million, and I get one million. A million dollars? We don't show up till she kicks the bucket. Dead. No, Jack. A little wooden bucket she kicks on its side. Are you okay? Oh, yeah. A little wooden bucket she kicks on its side. You do. Sorry. <laughs> we keep our ears low to the ground, and when it goes, we send it home. It'll never work. Yes, it will. No, it won't. We don't know anything about Max and Steve, and we don't know anybody from York, Pennsylvania. Oh, my gosh. Thanks. Wait. Hi, I bet you're wondering why I'm dressed up like this. It's very cheerful. It's my first day at the Taste Fight. See? The egg is lost a bit in the middle. I know it's a commute and all, but I figure it's worth it if it helps me get through college. You live in New York? Yeah. You wouldn't happen to know Miss Florence Snyder, would you? Are you kidding? When I worked for a doctor, she came to the office like every day. And do you know when she last saw Max and Steve? 1920. How old were they? Six and four. Their mother's name? Jenny. Father's? Herb. Yes. Oh, no. And how's she doing? Oh, she's dead. She died this morning. Oh, crap. Yeah, I know. It's awful. And um, what about that, Sissy? Has anyone heard anything from her? Nope, I'm not a word. She said she'd come up. It's fine. That was Max. She thought Max was a comedian when she was 
in the theater? Yeah, you're gonna say Yeah, I guess. Is there anything else you ever said about it? A stink scar, a limb? Nope. Just average people. Not that Steve is like deaf and dumb, but that's about all. Deaf and dumb? Yeah. My name's Audrey. Jack. Jack game. Like Barbie. Hey! You're cute. I'll see you later. She thinks I'm cute. Fine, you're cute. And you'll be deaf and dumb too. And I'll do all the talking. Oh, stop. Go back a couple Okay, I'll just... Yeah, I'll, I'll get right there, too. Yeah. Fine, you're cute, and you'll be deaf and dumb, too, and I'll do all the talking. Oh, stop it. Why not? It's perfect. Because I don't know anything about sign language. So, make it up. It's easy. It is not easy. Yes, it is. Try it. Say yes. Say no. I don't know. Maybe. <laughs> I'm hungry. I'm thirsty. All right, good. Stop it. Stop it, Jack! It's not funny! <laughs> I'm sure that's not real sign language. We'll say it's a new system, signing for the symbol. You can read lips, but only so my... We're going to have a sign up there. Right, so strange. Yeah, we're making a prayer system. Now, the problem is, Audrey lives in New York, and she saw you talking just now, so... Try it with this hat. Hey, have a moment. Pause it, so... Sneak 100. You know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> so, she saw you on the hat. She saw you. Yeah, so. Audrey saw you. Audrey saw you talking. And she lives in New York. So. Try this. Try this. That's better. Sorry, I forgot my. Hey! Who's he? Him? I don't think you've met him. I haven't? No, you met Jack, an old friend. This is my brother, Steve. Steve? No kidding. Hi, how are you? Oh, I'm sorry, he can't hear you. He's deaf and dumb. Holy cow, that's incredible. <laughs> Usually I never even hear about anybody being deaf. Now it comes up twice. What a coincidence. Two deaf people named Steve. Two? Yeah. Do you remember? Two girls we talked about. Max and Steve. Two girls! Yeah, their real names are Maxine and Stephanie. Maxine and Stephanie? Well, that's great. He's <laughs> gonna review it. He's gonna review it. You guys. Are, hey, you you just... to, are you supposed to look? He spoke. Yeah. Oh, that's great. Hey! <laughs> hey, he just talked! Amazing! <laughs> look, girls. You know, he talks very well for a beginner. Congratulations! You're making terrific progress. Thank you. <laughs> Dang it! You're so close! At least I can talk now. Oh, great. <laughs> Remember this one? We had the knockout actress Juliet and I used to say, Pardon me, would you climb up my balcony? <laughs> and the taming of the shrew, when I said, if I be waspish, best be where my steam. No. Yes. No. Yes, we can do it. I'll be Maxine. Go be Stephanie. I'm not doing it. Why not? Because I don't. Because oh, I. Oh, wait. No, no. I messed the line. I always mess it. No, I, I, you didn't. I just always mess this line. Let's go back. Okay. Wait, yes, we can do it. I'll be Maxine. Go be Stephanie. I'm not doing it. For a million dollars, the question is what dress do you wear? I'm not doing it. Why not? Because I'm a guy, a boy, a man. Jack, who do you think played the women's roles in Shakespeare's time? Huh? Boys? And how did they do it? Small brazoos. <laughs> no, they did it with conviction. With sheer talent, because they're actors like you and me. No. I'll take that as a yes. Now, we'll get off to the next station, get into our costumes, send a telegram, and then it's off the yard. <laughs> Big brain. <laughs> what you see to you? It's where someone's taped someone under the swing and Transition, transition, transition.
happiest memories in the world is when my father took me to Philadelphia to see scenes from Shakespeare. Oh, my favorite was Twelfth Night. <clears throat> my senior project of the Royal Academy was Twelfth Night. The Royal Academy of Fine Arts in London? Well, you're my hero. I am? Of course. If I could do anything in the world, I'd be an actress. I'd recite Shakespeare every night and let the words tremble out of me like a waterfall. I'd want to play Viola. Good night. Let me see your face. Do you have any connection with your lord to see my face? Oh, if I did love you on my master's day, I would not find it. I would have no sense. Why? What would you do? Just make me a little of cabin at your really day, and make the bad and gods of the air cry out, Olivia. You should get married. I'm kind of curious. Oh, Do they just like go off and die or something? Him? You're getting Bell. married to broken cousins? Wooly, yes, of course. You see, he was friends with my mother and father, and he was very kind to me when they passed away. Uh, I guess that's what love is, don't you think? Having something you can share and letting it grow. Oh, my dear. Love is like lightning. It makes you angry.
Transition. 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 Oh, yeah, sure. Look, if you're here, you just walk in and you're like, just like, it's <gasps> fast. All right. Rather than being extremely <laughs> creepy. <laughs> Go find Maxine. 
front of everybody? But in 10 days, you'll be doing it in front of a crowd of 100 do people. Okay. Mm -hmm. So then I'm going to make just Eat copies. Your... So how do we fill it out? Are you going to I guess I'm going to today and relax give them a the check with just patience. Um, okay. <laughs> All right. Or we can Not go yeah. Leo! When I heard you were in town, I thought, I gotta stop by. Like for five days. I mean, go ask Yeah. Oh, oh my gosh. Hi. Remember me? Met on the train. Hi. I'm Doc Myers. Everyone, everyone, we're having a rehearsal. <laughs> Alright, guys. Pause and come have a seat in front of me. What just happened? Two weeks. Oh, yeah, to perform. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. Dr. Zoidberg. <laughs>